So Laura, you've played the Sunshine Girls four times last year with a with a home, but they'll have their home crowd and they'll be strengthened team from what you played last year. What are you expecting from them next week? Um, it's actually my first time going to Jamaica and playing um, playing the Sunshine Girls in front of their home crowd. So I think that will be a bit of an experience in itself. Um, and also just the physicality of, of the game. Those girls are extremely athletic and, you know, their vertical jumps and their flair, I suppose, on the court is um, is quite amazing. So, yeah, that will definitely, definitely be a bit of a task to handle. And you'll be going head-to-head -head with your Queensland Firebird teammate, Romelda. Um, how, how are you feeling about this? What do you expect from playing with her? Is it difficult to play with her? Um, I actually, I quite enjoy playing on Romelda. It's a, it's definitely a little bit of fun. She'll um, give the occasional pinch on the on the bottom every so often and, and have a little bit of fun. But, yeah, she can be very serious. So um, I think when you're tackling Romelda on court, you really need to try to get into her head and, and put her off her game as much as possible and, you know, hope... To, to God that she starts missing a few shots. So, yeah, I think it's a, a very mental battle with, with Romelda, but, you know, playing with her at the Firebirds um, is the best place to, to understand and get to know her game. So very lucky in that respect. And so you'll be playing against one of your teammates, but you'll also be playing with three of your teammates, with um, um, Nat, Lauren and Amy. Does, is it good to play with some of your um, ANZA Championship teammates? It's fantastic to have um, to have such a large contingent of the Firebirds in the Aussie team now and you know to travel with them we all get along very well. We've got a great group in Queensland so it's it's nice to, to have some of your closest friends travelling with you and, and to enjoy the experience and hopefully it's going to be an exciting tour. Um, will you have any downtime to enjoy any of local Jamaican stuff? Um, we're a little bit excited about hitting the shops in LA at the moment. I think um, the, the opportunity to, to go around and have a look at LA, once again, I've never really been there. So hopefully there and in Jamaica we'll get a little bit of downtime. We don't have that much time on tours to, to check out the scenery of the destinations that we're at. But yeah, fingers crossed this time might be different.